वेलकम टू द ऑप्टिमम कैट सॉल्यूशन आई एम पंकज अकबर की वंस अगेन विल स्टार्ट आवर फ्री ऑनलाइन कोर्स दैट इज प्लास्टिक प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन एंड एडवांस कटिया टुडे वी आर मूविंग टुवर्ड्स द ट्यूटोरियल नंबर 13 दैट इज एप्लीकेशन ऑफ ए रिब्स ड्यूरिंग द डिजाइन ऑफ द कवर सो इन आवर ऑनलाइन कोर्स कंटेंट वी ऑलरेडी कवर द प्लास्टिक प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन इंट्रोडक्शन डोमेन्स इन ऑटोमोबाइल डिजाइन प्लास्टिक प्रोडक्ट डिजाइन थ्योरी एंड करेंटली वी आर एट एडवांस कटिया सो ऑल दिस कोर्सेज एंड द ट्यूटोरियल्स आर अवेलेबल ऑन आवर यूट्यूब चैनल so this is our today's task that is the design of a plastic cover with an application of the ribs so those ribs we are going to design in our tutorial number 13 so let's open the katia we'll open the new part as a cover we'll take a origin point and axis system with the reference of origin Now we'll start with the sketch, position sketch. So here we are in the sketch. So we'll draw the basic line diagram firstly. So those are the imaginary dimensions we are giving. So whatever the dimensions you want, you can you can refer, you can keep as it is also. so we keep uh, this as a 35 mm angle is a 1 degree which is the draft angle which necessary for tooling parts and here the sketch is get completed now we'll use the extrude command extrude yes so 200 mm will give some radius is here it is of a 20 mm so as the necessary draft for tooling we keep we mostly required 0.5 mm so at this area also we need a draft that's why we are using the sweep command with the draft of a 1 degree we'll enclose this one okay here you can see the draft is available so this is the simple part that's why the tooling direction we we had not taken a tooling line or a tooling direction line in roughly the z direction is a tooling line so now we'll give some charm for here So some as per the the application of a cover and the use of a cover as we are giving as we are taken it is as it is an imaginary so we'll just keep some chamfer here so now we'll extrude this one and we'll split the required from the required surface over oh, here you can see the chamfer is get applied now we'll move towards the keyhole or a whatever the application hole as we are designing this cover so uh, it has some opening so we are just designing that opening here so whatever the shape of a opening just we are keeping here some rectangular shape having some radiuses at the corners
so from this you can see the sketch so it is easy to visible now now here the sketches get completed as similar this is the drafted portion and having the tooling direction necessary so we'll keep the one degree draft against the tooling direction and the dimension will keep a 25 mm above so it's a reverse so here you can see the draft the draft should be inward and outward or a direction of the draft it is depends upon the direction of it to tooling direction so as this is the very simple object so we'll keep directly z direction of this surface as a tooling so we splitted this both surfaces here now we can see the pocket hole is achieved in our component so we'll queue the radius of a 1mm here now we need to close that pocket so that pocket should have some opening also positive opening so with having some flanges entry flange so just i offset it by 8 mm and we'll close this one and again we'll cut i will split that particular part and finally we'll join everything so we need to join all surfaces here so join is necessary before giving the radius here so we we joined everything do not miss any surface to join once you join everything then and then only the radius is applicable or it can be applied so now here the a surface is get completed so now we'll moving towards the b surface with having 2 mm thickness so here inside you can see i offsetted that surface so this is the a surface the green one is a b surface so it is easily uh, visible now uh, by application of the colors now we'll create the closing surface so we need to close this one that's why we are using the boundaries and multi-section solids so you can use any kind of a method but for simplification i'm using the multi-sections here So for proper joining we need to do all couplings and finally here you can see the multi section is get created for simply visualization i will just hide the boundaries now you can see a b and c surface also we need to close this one to convert the surface into the solid we are using the close volume and for that our total part should be the close so we had close by using closing surfaces here and finally we'll join a surface b surface and closing multi-section surfaces here so here you can see this is the closed surface so now we will give some name here cover and we'll enter into the cover surfaces and we'll enter into the part design part design now we'll use the bodies here so this will be the cover final cover and we are using the 
close surface here so you can see that surface get converted into the solid so whatever this closing surface is it is get filled with the solid here so now we'll moving towards the main part of our tutorial that is how to apply the ribs ribs are used for strengthening the particular part which having the function to give the uh, strength with stand against the application of the loads and uh, the thickness is most important for any particular rib to avoid the plastic defects use the necessary dimensions we are just giving the reference here so thick use the thickness here 1.5 neutral and we'll apply the draft rim do not forget to apply the draft here so we need to apply the draft against the tooling direction so in our component z direction is a tooling direction so we'll use the 0.5 mm draft here you can see the draft is in a z direction so same way so we'll increase the dimensions as a 180 We'll apply some smoothness there and finally we'll use the pattern command for increasing the number of ribs so here we we need to select the reference direction here number of a instances and the distance so at the 14 40 distance 40 mm distance there are the three instances in the y direction so we'll give uh, we'll apply the, the those are the horizontal ribs we'll apply the vertical ribs also so we'll start with the end here and uh, by measuring the dimensions we'll check how many instance instances can be applicable here so here the ribs use the pad command with rib, with using the thick options so here similarly we have created the ribs here now just apply the draft in the direction of a tooling having the 0.5 mm directions draft direction similarly uh, we'll use the pattern command here so whatever the instant instances and the spacing you can use so here you can see that the rib circuit completed so we'll add these ribs into one one cover ribs so both the ribs are get added and that's why we are using the intersections for adding the radius is here so while designing any plastic component you must have to give minimum 0.5 mm radiuses which are helps to eject the part from the tool so after completing this ribs we need to union with this cover so we are using the union trim command here so just select the cover ribs and select the cover and we need to select the faces to remove so we just selecting the faces to remove so here the removing surfaces are get selected if you forget any surfaces then just um, double click on a trim and uh, reselect that surfaces 
so here you can see the ribs are get completed so the gap between that wall and rib is very less so just we redimensioning the cutout so we'll keep as a uh, 17 So now screw bosses are get pending here. So just will moving towards design of the screw boss. So we'll add the four screw bosses at the each corner, which having the 10 mm dimensions. That is the diameter and which is used for M6 so firstly we'll design the true screw bosses we'll add the draft also and we'll mirror against the middle plane so here we mirror that two screw bosses against the middle plane now we'll add into the main cover the draft is get pent pending so we'll apply the draft also so at the time both are not possible here yes so we'll do the separately So here the cover is get completed so you can see here now we'll apply the m6 hole here on the screw bosses so just select the radius that is the circular portion of your screw boss and give the surface apply the dimensions flat v belt V bottom okay just you can see the whole circuit completed on our screw bosses similarly we can do same process for all screw bosses so this is the last one so here our today's tutorial that is the designing of the plastic cover with an application of the ribs is get completed here you can see having the pocket for entry uh, of any particular uh, equipments it may be the wire and uh, a, uh, any portion of uh, so here the today's video is get completed so thank you for watching our youtube channel guys hope you all are safe under this covid pandemic i'm requesting you to follow all the government guidelines wash your hand regularly wear the mask be aware be safe and finally do not forget to subscribe our youtube channel like share our videos and hit the bell icon thank you